In this demonstration, we'll see how we can import a multi-page PDF and how ArtCam breaks it down to bitmap layer vector layers and how we can go on to smart engraving this to allow it to be an embossing plate for this book cover. First thing we're going to do is just drag in our PDF file. Then we're going to set up our height and our width of our piece and just select OK. So we can now see it importing into different pages for bitmaps and also vectors. Now we'll just flick the, through these so we can see exactly what they look like. We'll just turn the vectors off. We can see through the first bitmap page this is everything coloured. Just have our little chef here. Got nothing on version 3 and nothing on page 4. Go through the same with the vector layers. Vector layer 1 is everything. Vector layer 2 is just all of the chef and the detail of him. 3 is the text. Page 4 is the borders. Now we're going to be using the whole thing. And we're then going to go ahead to machine this. So we're just going to select everything. Come across to our toolpaths tab. And open our smart engraving wizard. Now this is only available within ArtCam Pro and ArtCam Insignia. We we'll type in our, st our finish depth of 1mm. And we're going to start to add some tools to this. Now the first tool we're going to add is going to be a 6mm end mill. Do the majority of the chunking away. Then we're going to add a 1.5mm end mill. Then we're going to come down to our much smaller tools. So we're going to pick this small flat conical tool here. And then we're going to go down to our 0.01mm tool for this as well. And we've also got the option as well to do corn sharpening. We've got quite a few options within this so we can change our speed rates, our feed rates, our step overs. We can engrave just the profile only so we can allow this tool just to trace around the profile. And we can allow it to have different finish depths to the other tools. Now we're going to select and set up our material. So we're going to have, this is a 3mm block. We're going to have it sitting at the top. And we're going to now calculate this. So you can see it's gone in with the biggest tools first and it slowly works its way down to the smaller tools. So it's done this quite quickly. If I just close this, hit draw solid, and turn off everything but my big tool so we can see exactly where the big tools got into. If I turn on my one and a half mil mm tool, change the colour, you can see all the parts that this tool's got to. Again, the same with the first small tool. So that's got into a lot, but there's still a few areas which it has missed. And then do exactly the same with the smallest tool. And then we can see the exact areas in which this has got. So it's traced all the way around the edge of the letters to do corner sharpening on them. Now if we come across to the 3D view. We hit the simulation button. We can see exactly much clearer our finished piece. So we can see how quickly and efficiently our toolpath can be created for engraving an embossing plate and how easily ArtCam Pro can import PDF files.